Hello friends and welcome back to Rogue Port. I am all kinds of emotional today because, well one, I just finished watching Schitt's Creek and it was a beautiful series end, I have to say. Um, also, we're having our very first snowfall here on Rogue Port and it is absolutely beautiful. I have never seen anything more magical in my life. Um, and as you can see, Colton has moved out. Goodbye, Colton. You will be dearly missed. Even though he stabbed me in the back that one time and wouldn't put up his wreath. But that's fine. That's fine. It's all forgiven. He has gone to a good home. I found somebody to adopt him. Um, he is now living right next door to Julian on her island. She sent me some pictures of her setup, which was super cute, and I appreciated it. So I am so happy for him and his new his new adventure. I think he will love being with his fellow smug friend. So yeah, that's super exciting. So today, let's see what we got here. We are going to do some villager hunting, which I'm very excited for. I haven't gone villager hunting in quite some time. Um, Oh, look, they're having a cute little conversation. It was super awkward. I um, was trying to have somebody come the other day, and Fang was sleeping right in front of the airport, so I had to, like, shove him out of the way. Um, <clears throat> also, the girl that came and picked up Colton brought me some blue roses and tipped me, which I did not ask for any of that. I was so surprised. I was like, oh my gosh, this is the nicest day ever but she was super appreciative to get him because she had been looking for him for quite some time she told me so I'm very glad that he is going to have a new family on a new island but yeah here's our updated um, Santa's meet and greet area I've been I swear I like undo it and redo it every single day <clears throat> I just, I don't know, I still feel like something's missing, but I think maybe once I get the Christmas tree items and I put some like around the side here, it'll look much better, so here's hoping for that, <clears throat> but yeah, I think it's looking better than it did. I also planted some, it looks much better with the pine trees behind the simple panels up on the top part, so I'm liking that much better, but yeah. We're gonna head right out and start our villager hunt. Oh, you know what? I didn't even grab my vaulting pole. Well, I can craft one. Although I don't even think I have an axe with me, so. <clears throat> Does Wilbur sell those? We'll find out. I'm gonna close my gate because I've been just wheeling and dealing all morning. Actually, I didn't make any deals. <clears throat> I just let people come and buy my, um, I have the orange robot for sale today in my nooks cranny, so I was letting people come and buy that and my other things that I didn't want. So that was fun. I got a lot of visitors this morning. So I don't really have like a set villager that I'm looking for right now. I mean, now I have to fill the smug spot and the snooty spot. So it could be either a smug or a snooty. Or if I see Tia or Molly, I'll probably take them. And now I've just been like looking at Fauna. I kind of like her too. So I'm just like, ugh. Because wouldn't it be cute to have Fauna and Bo, like, living near each other? That would be cute. But, I don't know. We'll just have to see what happens. Yeah, I should have grabbed my bolting pole. This isn't going to go well. Oh, my God. 
And now I have to like start playing on my boyfriend's account because I don't want a tent on my island. <laughs> so we got to get his house upgraded because he's he's not going to play unless I make him. So <laughs> I'll just have to work on that. But I don't even have my own house like decorated. So it's all just a work in progress. I feel like I never focus on the inside of my house that's like once my island is more settled I'll worry about it but I did put in this cute little garden that I'll have to show off but I'm planning on doing a um, museum decorating video so We'll see it. We'll see it when we do that. Because I finally got my museum to where I want it. It's in the same spot. It's literally just like one foot over. Aw, okay. I really wanted her on my other island. Sherry. I think she's so cute. <clears throat> Aw, she's so cute. I feel like if I didn't have Pashmina, I would want her. I love her yellow hands and feet. They make me happy. Oh, I should have brought water with me. <clears throat> I moved my setup to my bedroom because, I don't know, I just thought it'd be cozier. We put a desk in here and it is like quieter and nice because now my dogs, I just bring them in here and they just nap on the bed. But it is, um less convenient for beverages. Also, we're hiding right now from the dog that I'm babysitting because she just kind of cries the whole day. <laughs> I've had her, I got her the Sunday before Thanksgiving. I usually take her for Christmas too, so I wonder if I'm going to have to do that. Um, I'm getting distracted. But yeah, we're dog sitting for it. She usually asks for two weeks, but then she usually calls me sometime during those two weeks and asks me to take her longer. Like, I usually have her for, like, a month minimum. But she's went to Texas with her husband to visit her daughter. It's an old co-worker of mine. And I'm her go-to dog sitter. Which I like the dog. She's very nice. She's cute. <clears throat> She's just elderly and <laughs> entitled. If she wants something, she'll just like, she just begs for food all day long. Like, is never not begging for food. If I'm like, you have designated breakfast and supper, so. No. Because could you imagine I give her back and she gained like 50 pounds? Oh. We got Celia over there. Oopsies. I'm like dying for CJ or Flick to come because I have so many wasps and sturgeon just in my inventory. I got everything. What am I doing? So I really would love it if one of them would show up on my island ever. And I'm sad because I missed like the last few days of the maple leaf DIYs because I like the whole week before Thanksgiving I was getting ready for Thanksgiving because I like cooked everything and like wanted my house to look beautiful for it. So it was a lot of work. So I didn't really have time to play. I did play the Thanksgiving event. 
And I love the items that we got with that. So that was very exciting. The other problem with my bedroom is that it's always really cold too. I'm gonna need to acquire some more blankets because right now my dogs are using all of mine. Rude. Oh, who's that, Becky? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> if anybody watched mm, the video about me and my boyfriend like making his character, I completely forgot about the campsite <laughs> visitor. But I went and checked afterwards and it was Brofina and he like loves her but I I didn't even tell him about it. He just likes her because he likes the name Brofina. So I didn't even tell him about it. I just let the day pass by. I was just like no. No chickens for me. I almost was tempted to take her though because I was like oh she is snooty and he likes her so. Oh, also, I switched my hair up, if you notice. I just didn't think my look, the bun looks good with this hat. So whenever I wear this hat, I'm just going to do this hair. But I like my bun with my other hat. But it's snowing, so I had to put on a little, little beanie. Oh, the heat just kicked on, thank goodness. That's how I know I'm not crazy, because every time that I'm like, ooh, it's getting cold in here, I'm freezing, the heat kicks on, so it obviously was getting cold. So thank you, house, for keeping me warm. Oh no, shut up. <laughs> Rang! Whoa, that's gonna be a hard one to leave. I wanna go see her. I don't have a pole. Frick. Oh my goodness. Do you sell poles? I feel like this happened to me before. I probably have like seven of the these poles in my storage because I just put them in there and forget to get them back out when I'm doing this. Oh my god, I just left. I wasn't even paying attention. Well, that solves that. Oh my god. Oh, I'm losing it. I opened an energy drink and I didn't drink it all and I'm just losing my mind. Okay. Well, that makes it, I'm, I'm kind of glad that happened because I didn't really want to take Meringue, but I feel guilted in taking her. What even is she? Let me look it up. Meringue. Isn't she normal? Yeah, she's normal, so like, if I want... <laughs> Marina, Tia, and Fauna, and Molly. I can't very well have Meringue, too. Although, I could see myself saying goodbye to Marina someday. She doesn't really fit my island vibes. But, I mean, neither does Audie. <laughs> but I can't ever let Audie go. She's like the one puppy that I want on this island. Sorry, Flora. I guess that means you're out, too. It's like I have this like vision for my island, but then I find somebody I'm just like, oh my god, I love you, no, stay. <laughs> and then I ruin it. I'm just falling apart over here. I stayed up too late watching TikToks. Cause you know you find one and it's on like messy talk and then you're down the rabbit hole of like these people's like having three different affairs with like 
the boyfriend's cousin and like just like so much drama and I have to know the whole story so yeah that was my night okay I can't believe it shut the frick up there's Tia stop all right okay well do I cry now I feel like I should cry Oh my god, we found her! I'm still shaking trees. I'm gonna cry. This has just been the most emotional day. Well, thank god I didn't take Meringue. See? All you haters. I, in my head, you're booing me. Why are you booing? I'm right. Um, we found her. We found our girl. She's coming home with us. I cannot believe this. How many tickets did I even use? Like... Five. I used five tickets. Holy moly, everybody. I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so excited, Tia. Her little house is going to look perfect. Perfect. Oh, I'm emotional. Nobody let me leave. <laughs> I'm just going to check for a DIY real quick, and then we will go get our girl. Okay, no DIYs. That's fine. That's fine. Because I got Tia. So I don't need anything else. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Well, there we go. I'm finally making a video that's under 30 minutes. Um, sorry for all the chaos. I'm, I swear I'm fine. I'm fine. We're, we're okay. I am okay. We are doing well. I will wrap it up here, I guess. Move to my island, Tia. Yes, I mean it, you adorable little baby. I love you. Of course I meant it. She's so cute. Oh my god. I'm so excited. Okay. Whew. Whew. I need to... I'm just gonna go and drink wine. I'm just... It's that day. I'm gonna make a bubble bath, drink some wine, and then I'm probably gonna come back at it again with the white vans. Damn Daniel. We got Tia. Just kidding. I'm gonna come back and we will, um... Obviously, we're done villager hunting, but I definitely want to um, do a museum build today, too. So, I will make that video and uh, post it when I figure out how to edit it. Okay. Well, thank you, everybody, for joining me on this journey. Make sure you like and subscribe for more chaotic, fun moments like this. Alright. bye bye from Rogueport. We'll see ya back on Rogueport.